Hey, this is Peter with Spring Tour. We're here in our kitchen because uh, that's where we do yeah. guest demos. We've got Edgar from American DJ who's going to tell us about this really cool product here. Hi there, how's it going? Uh, my name is Edgar, and uh, right here I'm using our Airstream DMX Bridge, which is uh, one of our iPad, even iPhone uh, controllers that you could use to control DMX lighting. Uh, as you see here, it's the app is pretty uh, easy to understand. You just have really just five pages where you have your fixtures, uh, you have your channels. These are basically like your DMX channels. So like right here, I have my focus beam LED, and if I wanted to tilt, I could uh, just tilt this back and forth real easily. So of course, with like uh, generic uh, DMX scenes, you can create scenes here. And so like right now I have this guy activated. If I push here, it deactivates it. So that's my stored scene. Uh, but what also is really cool is some of the effects that are built in. So as I select a fixture, you'll see them get highlighted here. And these are kind of brand new fixtures. Uh, all I had to do was just use the DMX traits to create the profiles. And then I grabbed uh, pictures from our website so if I was, let's say, a school or in a house of worship and I said, hey, can you control that one fixture? Let's call it the Focus Beam LED or Busy Wash Z19. Average person is probably not going to know what that is. But if you put the picture there, it says it here. You can name them and then you can add the picture. So it makes it really easy for anyone to understand. Uh, but as far as effects, I'll go here uh, and I have my pan and tilt. And this is really cool. So if I wanted a circle effect, it does that. If I just hit play, my moving head will start to do a circle. If I had a larger area, I can increase the size of the circle. I can also shrink it and move it around so that, let's say, I just wanted it dedicated in one area. I could do that. I could even draw in my own effect. So if I wanted a figure eight, get that. And then what's really neat, too, is I could slow down or increase the speed. But if I push speed, and let's say I had four or eight of these fixtures, I could just tap there, and then I have my offset. So what it'll do is create that searchlight effect. Uh, so there's movement, pan and tilt effects, and also uh, color effects. So this works great for pars or moving heads that, like this guy here that has wash type of effects. Uh, you can go in and do some color effects. So if I had, uh, let's say, a product compatible with this is our Element Par, which has wireless DMX, our Wi-Fi already built in. I could just have those playing, and it would start doing this color range here. If I wanted just my blues and purples, I can slide this over and now it's just going to be doing that and then it'll show you your effect and then same goes here for your for your offsetting so if you had multiple pars i can just do this and then you'll start to see breakups right now i only have one so it's only showing me that but this is probably one of the best parts about it too is uh, you have your scenes your shows but it's also a lockout uh feature so you can lock out so you don't have any control of your fixtures or your channels so you can't mess up any shows and all you have access to is your scenes and shows so it's a free download if you're an iPad or iPhone user. Tell us about the interface over here and how oh. it works with your uh, Wi-Fi products. Right. So here's the actual interface. This is kind of what you're paying for when you get the Airstream DMX Bridge. All right. So here's the interface for the Airstream DMX Bridge. Uh, basically, you have your two antennas here. And what they're doing is one is our protocol for wireless, which is called Wi-Fi. That's your wireless DMX. And the other is your router. So this will create your own network on wireless 2.44. So you could be out anywhere as long as this gets power. This is going to create your network so you can talk to your iPad or iPhone wirelessly. Uh, you have your DMX hardwire out and also your power here. Your USB for any kind of uh, firmware updates that might be available for this. And then your power switch. What's nice about it, it does have a magnetic base here. So if you wanted to just slap this onto a metal object, you could do that. But there's also a bracket included, so if you wanted to put this on Yeah, let's stress. put it on the refrigerator. Let's show oh, yeah. how that works. Will it even reach? Now it won't reach. You know what? I'll unplug it. It's okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. So there you go. <laughs> DMX from your refrigerator, folks. Edgar, thank you very much. All right, you got it. Thank you.